Good morning, Australia. It's time for the scoop with me, Darren. <laughs> Joining me today is one of everyone's favourite humanoids. Please welcome Will. Oh, thanks, Darren. You're one of my favourite robots. One of your favourite robots? Uh, who are the others? Uh, hey, isn't it time for Darren's challenge? Oh, affirmative. It's time for Darren's challenge. <laughs> Water is a feature of many games, but which game does this particular water come from? Answer at the end of the scoop. Now to the news. First up, hold on to your buttons, gamers, because PlayStation recently dropped a bombshell revelation. According to PlayStation, the commonly known X button is actually officially called the cross button. Social media furor ensued. Even Xbox weighed in. So let me get across this. Players were cross that the cross is actually not called an X? Exactly. Uh, does this come as a jewel shock to you, Boatmeal? Ah, <laughs> oh, fair point. Uh, he thinks it makes sense because, as PlayStation UK pointed out, we don't call the circle button an O, do we? Oh, well, I think this debate will continue to push people's buttons. Oh, affirmative. Now, Nintendo's latest foray into fitness gaming has got me thinking about gamer size. Hmm. So let's work it out in Darren's dialogue box. <laughs> Nintendo recently announced their Ring Con peripheral and companion adventure game. So, does gamifying fitness make exercise more fun? Or will this be just another expensive plastic peripheral in the cupboard? What do you think, Will? Well, Nintendo's not exactly reinventing the wheel or ring here. Remember Wii Fit? That was hugely popular. Oh, affirmative. And fitness gaming, or exa gaming, can have a range of uses. Wii Fit and the Balance Board have been used for physical therapy and in aged care. Right, plus integrating the fitness stuff with an adventure game is kind of intriguing. So look, I'll give it a chance. Let's get physical, physical. <laughs> <laughs> Right, moving on now to the extra scoop. What have you got, Will? Well, a game jammer known as Solly has created the classic strategy game Sid Meier Civilization in Microsoft Excel. Known as cell Evization, it includes the ability to build up units and attack opponents with plans to add even more features. Splendid! If there's one thing I like more than spreadsheets, it's world domination! <laughs> now, before we go, it's time for the answer to Darren's challenge! The water pictured here comes from Sea of Thieves! Oh, wow, the sea from Sea of Thieves! It's quite the celebrity! <laughs> Now, all jokes aside, that's all the scoop we have for today. Until next week, good night, Australia. I might have to start training now for that ring con thing. I could train you, Will. Engage your core. No pain, no gain. <laughs>